a day at the park is supposed to be filled with fun and leisure, but for some in Winsboro, it's anything but. Fox 14's Brian Briggs caught up with the Franklin Parish Police Jury to find out what their plan is to fix up some of their parks. They are in less than standard conditions. It's anything but a walk in the park for two of Winsboro's community parks. Esther Credit and Efren Rollins Memorial Parks are dealing with aging, failed past upgrades and crime, which has led them in their current condition. But the Franklin Parish Police Jury and the Winsboro Main Street Economic Development Committee are teaming up to give the parks the TLC they need. Their plan is to overhaul everything existing at both parks. I have a vision and what I would love to see is for them to actually look like a park. And when I say that, I'd like to see updated swings. I would like to see swings, period. I'd like to see updated playground equipment. I'd love to see decent, working, functional basketball park areas. I'd like to see a striped basketball court, if possible. Fencing, lighting, just basic necessities of what a park should have. With money already set aside. It's very small. Um, but we have a budget set aside for both parks. But they can't do it alone because the budget can't cover everything needed. It's going to take community efforts. It's going to take donations. It's going to take people just really getting out there and putting in the work, myself included. Residents tell me they've been hearing about updates in the past, but I've seen very little to no progress. We normally use it every day, but once they came over here trying to fix on it stuff, they supposed to be fixing on it. Then they just put the little ramp thing up, the little shed, and then they stop. A year went by, and the same thing. They came, messed up our yard. But residents are hopeful to see changes this time around. Since she's just not getting in, we're going to give her a try and see what she's going to do. In Winsboro, Brian Briggs, Fox 14 News. Wesby says there's no firm start time on these projects and that the renovations will not happen overnight, a process that will take at least several months.